All right, this is a quick little video of myself on the radio. It was a fun thing for, my, for myself because I've never been on the radio and kind of a shy kind of person, so it was cool to do. Mr. Uh, Bill Sancy, as a uh, host of Confest Radio, Blog Talk Radio, he uh, invited me on and is uh, going to get me on the show. I run my crew Wolfpack Signage, so he is uh, one of the biggest Argo fans, the Toronto Argonauts, who just won the Grey Cup, that is, 2012. Uh, he he, he uh, recognizes all the hard work that I've been doing on the field for nine years straight, never missing a game, so much respect for him. And Gene A. Mack, the former Toronto Argonaut you're going to hear, he, he also uh, talks to me and thanks me. And... Uh, I respect him for all his hard work that he put in in the 70s as a player and he was an actor uh, or currently is an actor and uh, has done some cool stuff in his life so this is uh, just a quick uh, preview. You are listening to Confess Radio. If we suddenly disappear it's because I hit the wrong button. But I want to see are we going to get is this going to work? Is this going to work? I'm calling up. It's ringing. Who would be down again? Surprise. He oh. doesn't even know. So let's keep listening. Oh, I had a feeling. Yes, hello. Hi, is this ready? Yes, speaking. You are on the air with Compass Sports with Bill and Gene. I thought he'd give it a try. This is amazing. It's a pleasure to be on with uh, Eugene and uh, Bill. I've been waiting uh, for a while now. I've just been very busy. I apologize. Uh, we couldn't ask for a better friend. This guy. Is this Randy and the Wolf? Randy and the Wolf! Yes, yeah, sir. This, this is Randy. Sorry, Gene. This is the leader of the Wolf Pack. Uh, I got a great crew of uh, a solid eight guys, and, and they're listening in. All right. Well, great to hear from you, man. I'm telling you the truth. Uh, well, I, uh, fr uh, not since the uh, first night uh, have I, we talked to you the first night, and that was it. So uh, are you having a good sports week? Yes, sir. I'm uh, actually involved with the NFL uh, Bills series for, uh, ever, well, ever since the beginning. Uh, it came back in, uh, in 2008, I believe, was the first game. Yeah. I, I, I do so many. I, uh, it's hard to keep track, but... <laughs> But yeah, like I've uh, got got that coming up uh, this Saturday and Sunday is the actual game day. So uh, a lot of planning and uh, logistics and, and and preparation is the key. I find just like with sports, right? Yeah. So so, so yes, I'm, I I try to uh, be like a coach slash quarterback with my guys and and, uh, and and I get right in there like a quarterback. You know, as well as uh, be a good uh, role model for them, like a coach, you know? Oh, I don't think they could have a better role model. You you make that dome look good, I'm telling you that. And one day, we're going to get you in here. We really are. Yeah. That, that was would be my great. work there. I mean, I'm a, 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 a usual a shy type personality, but you guys are great people. I would love to come on air. And, and, and uh, I love the Argos. Who, who, who wouldn't? Our Grey Cup champs, so go Argos. We're going to take it in 2013 and then get on a roll. I can feel it. Repeat. Yeah, I'm with you. Well, that, that, that's right. Uh, Randy, we got about two minutes. In that's one right. Minute I... or less, in one minute or less, <laughs> give us your feelings about the Hamilton Tiger Cats problem. But that's one word, boo. I... I uh, it's gonna have. It's a nightmare scenario for them. They're gonna have to do some uh, quick adapting to all the changes that are gonna surround them all. And uh, best of luck to them. I mean, uh, I, I, I I'm always supporting my Argos above any other team. Yeah. But uh, I, I feel for them. I, I, I don't see it being a, a very good year for them. Uh, I think 2000, once their stadium is built and they, they have uh, their management, uh, you know, getting to know each other much more, 
uh, I think the confidence will start to uh, boost that and, and things will get better, uh, give it a few years, maybe. <laughs> yeah, I agree with you there. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. Coming from someone who knows the Tiger Cats probably just as well as he knows the Arlen <laughs> he thinks they're going to bite hind kit next year, all the way to the bottom. Well, they will be. But, Reddy, I had to call. I had to just put you on the spot to surprise you because I've been waiting for you. You do so much for Comfest Radio. I want to thank you. I'm going to continue to be uh, one of your lo most loyal fans and, and spread the word. You guys are doing a great job. Thank you, Gene. Thank you, Bill. And I'll uh, let you guys go, and we'll be speaking soon, I'm sure. For sure, man. Thanks a lot. Have All right. Take, take care. Thanks, man. Well, gee, that was a lot. That was a fast night. We got about 20 seconds left. I gotta throw a shout out once again, John, Frank, Jamie of the Argo Admirals. Thank you for calling and tweeting out on the show. Uh, pardon me about the show. You just heard from the great Randy of the Wolf Pack, guys. Gee, it's been a pleasure once again, as always. Oh, thanks everybody for listening to Confess Radio and the Confess Global Community Film Festival. <laughs> And that's that. Wolfpack, proud to be uh, able to do what we do. We will consistently do our work and refine our techniques and make everyone proud. Shout out to my family. I love y'all. Thank you, Bill and Jean. Thank you to my team, most of all, for allowing me to be uh, the leader and the man that I am. You know, you guys inspire me. <laughs>